Today we're creating this glitter text effect on Canva. Janet Raimundo Arizoba has requested us to create this quick video that's going to take step one, two, three, and then you've got the beautiful glamour effect on your text. Join me, let's create this logo. Step number one would be for you to press T for text and then add the text for which you would like to use the glitter effect that we're creating on Canva. So I'm going to be creating a logo. I want a nice, big, bold logo font. So I'm, I'm gonna use this April Fat Case I saw on one of the videos on YouTube here. It worked quite nicely. So you would write the name of the business that you're designing for. Next, I'm going to change the text and make it white. Then I'm gonna press R for rectangle so that I can create a rectangle. I like my, my brand color. I'll go for pink and then put the rectangle behind the name of the business that I'm designing for. Or whatever design you're running for, Janet, this is for you. Next, this is done. You're gonna go to your share. You're gonna download it and your step number one is done. I am a fan of keeping the work that I've done already, so therefore, I'm gonna add a second page, drag the download that I've just done and load it on my canvas. And then I'm going to click and select the canvas, change it to black so that I can see what I'm busy doing. And then I'm gonna select my image and remove the background of the image. So if you don't have remove.bg, you're welcome to trial it for 30 days using the the link below. However, you can use remove.bg or erase.bg. And looking at this, I can see the small little piece that's stayed behind. Therefore, that's why we have the erase tool for cases like that. Then I'm going to zoom in a little bit, reduce my brush size and go a little bit slow and take off that small little white that's left over there so that it's completely gone then i'm going to click on done and then I'm, it's gone i'm happy then i'm going to click on apply then i will take off the extra space that's left over there and zoom a little bit out like that then i'm happy so step number two you're going to go to your elements and you're going to look for gold glitter or pink glitter whatever kind of glitter that you would like your logo or the text that you're creating to sparkle with. So you can scroll down until you find a picture or an image of the glitter that speaks to you and that you want to use. I loved this one. So you click on it once and you send it to bed one. And then you size the glitter on your text like that. Once you're done, you're going to change your background and make it pink, the same color as your rectangle that you chose. Once you're done, you're going to download the second page with your Glamour Girls behind, which is page two. And then you're off to the last step. I would add the last page and you would drag your design that you just downloaded. And then it has automatically selected. You're gonna click on edit image and you remove the background. And we click on apply, we can see it now. So we're gonna change our background and make that a nice black. And there's your text. Glamorized, glittering, as easy as that. Crop out the extra space and then drag it so that you have your Glamour Girls glitter. So it's based on what kind of the background glitter that you get for you to get the nice effect that you want. So play around with the different kinds of glitters and see which one speaks to you the most, but that is how you, you create a glitter effect. I hope that makes sense for you, to you, Janet. So if you want to do an icon, you go find an icon that has color in it so that you're able to take off the background and change it to white exactly the way that we've done just now. And you follow the three steps and you convert it and you add it 
on whatever kind of design that you want to do. So I'm going to fast forward this process because it's exactly the same. Thank you for joining me on this tutorial. Don't forget to like and share the video so that YouTube can show it to more people that we could help with our design. I will see you on the next video.